Yo, yo. yo Sports Life and Hip Hop. We are on location today at Hotel Audrey. Zeke is here. We Space Boy Kenny is here. <laughs> Space ETU Boy. is here. We here. Billionaire Mike is here. We all here. We all Raymond here. is here. Shout out, shout out to the guests of Chicago Hotel Collection, Magnificent Mile. There you go. There you go. Boy right here. <laughs> Yo, Sports Life and Hip Hop. Uh, we're about to talk to Space Boy Kenny. Shout out to Space Boy Kenny, Vegas, Cali in the building. Sports Life and Hip Hop. New Mexico. <laughs> ABQ. Yo, yo, Sports Life and Hip Hop. Uh, we are on location today. Zeke live. And I, live. Ricky Swade, Zeke. We downtown Chicago, Hotel Aubrey. Uh, we got a special guest today uh, hailing from Cali via By Vegas. By way of Vegas. By way of Vegas, yeah. Space Boy yeah. Kenny. What's up, everybody? <laughs> what's up, what's up, what's up? How y'all doing? Good, good. Um, first of all, what brings you out here, first and foremost? Shit, y'all motherfuckers brought me out here. No, <laughs> but now we got a few videos we're going to shoot, and um, just uh, we're just trying to network and link with people, too. So, mm -hmm. yeah, shout out to y'all for having us out here, too. Oh, no problem, no problem. Uh, shout, out, shout out to E, you know what I'm saying, Magic E. ETU cool, E cool as fuck, you know what I'm saying? ETU. ETU. Um, where, where originally, like, you're, you're from Cali, so... Give us a little bit of background of you. All right, so originally I'm from Cali. I grew up in um, Palmdale, California. Well, I was born in Palmdale, California. Moved to a small city called California City. If you know about California City, then you really lived in the fucking yeah, I never southern heard of, of fucking California. It's, it's SoCal for sure. Only the SoCal babies know about that shit. But yeah, I grew up over there and then moved down to Palm Springs too. So I was in Palm Springs for a minute. Um, and after that, I ended up moving to New Mexico because um, well, my family, my sister, she's in the military and like she got like my, my nieces and shit. And so I was helping her like take care of the kids and stuff. Okay. So yeah, we ended up all the way to fuck uh, middle of nowhere, Albuquerque, New Mexico. And now I'm back uh, in Las yeah, Vegas. It is. Yes. Yep. It actually is. I went to the high school where they oh, shot Breaking really? Bad. Yep. <laughs> oh. Crazy. You went to check it out, or that's where you actually went? No, that's where I actually oh, went actually, to high school. Oh, oh yeah. shit. <laughs> like, uh, like, right across my uh, my chemistry room, like, right across was literally the room where they shot Breaking Bad in. It was crazy. Oh, okay. Mm. So, you're a musician, obviously. Uh, well, I don't say obviously. Uh, yeah, what is your occupation? Yeah, is I'm a porn star. <laughs> 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 what? I make music. I'm just kidding. What? Uh, I make porn on the low sometimes. <laughs> Oh, that was serious. Oh, that was dead ass. Oh, yeah. shit. Maybe. You can find me on OnlyFans and Christian Mingle. <laughs> <laughs> so what would you uh, what would you describe your music? What genre? Um, I like to put my music in a genre of, like, um, emotions. Because okay. I feel like um, I kind of do, like, everything. I make, like, alternative music, but, like, as far as like what pertains to my music is always going to have to do with something like with my emotions and how I was feeling. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I, I like to say like I'm an emotional artist, I guess you could say. Mm -hmm. I get emo music type shit. Oh, yeah, emo music. So do you get offended if someone calls you a rapper? No, 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 I don't actually. But I'm an artist, though, on my Kanye West shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, okay. I, I'm just kidding. I think it's corny as fuck if people get like offended if you're like, yo, I'm a rapper. So some people do. Yeah, rapper. some people do get offended. <laughs> Like, I think Post Malone was on some, like, yo, I'm not really a rapper. I'm, I'm more than that. I'm not, I, you know, I'm not a rapper. I'm an artist, you know. I, I don't make rap music. You know, I might, I might rap, but I don't make rap music. I make, you know, I just make whatever I like. You can't really categorize it or put me in a box or anything, you know. Um, I think it just comes out. Post Malone, that makes sense. Like, he, I don't consider him a rapper, to be honest. I think I'm more of a singer. That's now, yeah. Like, yeah. That, like, yeah, I guess I can see where some people would get, like, I don't know. Since we're at the beginning stages of, of, of finding out your background or whatnot and, and people want to know, like, what is, what is a musician, what is, a, what is music or what is a, what song or CD hit you was like, yo, I could do this. Like, this is my calling, this is my passion. Is there a, mu a musician or a rapper or an artist, whatever, that really made you, you know, come out and say, yo, like, I love this. This is my passion. This is what I want to do. Hmm. That's a fucking crazy good question. But um, honestly, 
It's just like ever since I was a little kid, I feel like I was able to like grasp and understand music on like a different level. So like I could be like on the, like I'll be sitting in the car listening to my mom listening to Tupac or some shit, like changes, and I'm like, damn, what the fuck? Like I understand everything he's talking about, but like I'm just a little ass kid. Like, I know I can't relate to it, but like just the way he's describing it, it's like I can picture how his life was, and it's like that just made me want to like make music. Cause I'm like, as a kid, I've always been like shy and like I've always had like a hard time talking and like speaking. And I feel like the main way to like to voice like how I truly feel and just to get my true thoughts out is like through music. Okay. And like that's just something I've always wanted. Like I've always wanted to be like a superhero and like <laughs> just to yeah, honestly, just like have powers and stuff. And I feel like the best way to do it is just like to communicate with people and like be there for them emotionally. I feel like that's the craziest superpower you could have. Did you grow up with both parents? Um <laughs> <laughs> uh, shout out to my pops uh, In and out of jail my whole life Nigga in jail right now Actually no he out He just got out My bad pops He just got out uh, Yeah Motherfucking Free pops Free pops Oh god hey, He free He actually free right free? now okay. I forgot He just got out last week okay. But Yeah my whole life That nigga been in and out of jail um, He a cool ass nigga though That's my motherfucking <laughs> <laughs> But uh, I kind of just always been on my own shit, just like, I don't know, just that middle child shit, just like always being on my own. Just mm. I never was really like a, a, like around my parents too much. I was more around like my grandparents. But, oh, uh, that's what I was leaning towards, like who raised you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My, uh, my grandma, and honestly, my grandma and my siblings raised me the most. My parents were like always busy, like always at work, so they never were really at home, to be honest. Just a bunch of badass kids running around doing their ass shit. So that's what my question was going to lead to. Uh, what, did your, what did your grandma say when you said, hey, I'm, I'm not going to get a job. I'm going to be a rapper or an artist. <laughs> Honestly, my grandma is like, she's always been like my number one supporter. Anything mm. I do, she just like, she got me. Even though like I be fucking up and being bad. <laughs> but she going she gonna to ride for me. She going to make sure I look innocent. She going to make sure everybody see me as a good kid, even if I'm out here doing some fuck shit. But, <laughs> so you got no pushback on this from anybody. Oh, no, 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 that's not true. My dad, <laughs> my dad used to give me hella pushback. This nigga, oh, like, you in the house recording, you need to be fucking, nigga, you, you know how much money this costs. Right. But you like, know you got to pay bills. Who, who in your family got the gene? Someone got the musical gene, right? Who, yeah, for sure. The, who, who has uh, it? Honestly, it's crazy. My dad used to make music, too. He used to um, oh, he used to make music. He used to dance, too. He was a pop locker. Oh, see? <laughs> the, the gene is real, y'all. Like, when people say they musicians, someone in their yeah, yeah, family yeah. is, for like, sure, for sure. a piano player Like, or I started because um, my brothers, it's crazy as fuck. Y'all niggas probably remember this shit. Y'all remember when there was a PlayStation 2 game where you could make the beats on there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you yeah. couldn't, like, fucking export it or anything. Yeah, right. yeah, yep, yep. So we, this is what we used to do. We used to record it on the PlayStation 2, mm -hmm. and then we had a karaoke machine. We would put the mic uh, up to that shit. Right? Uh, MTV Music Generator, I think. I think mm -hmm. so. I can't remember the name of it, but it was, like, that PlayStation 2 game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But you can make, you can make some crazy-ass beats on yeah. there, bro. If someone can you, figure out... people started off on that. On God. If you can figure out how to get those beats off of there, I'm pretty sure you can make some crazy shit. <laughs> but... Yeah, so we used to do that. I recorded with the karaoke machine, and I was probably like, I was young as fuck. I, I was no older than like eight, and they would just have me like sit down there and just like um, record with them. And it's like I just eventually like just started doing it on my own. It's funny because like they always encouraged me to do it, but like I just like I kind of like pushed it away. I was like, nah, fuck no. I'm like weird. I'm like I don't want to be like y'all niggas. <laughs> but like <laughs> it came to a point. I was like, I actually hold up. I really want to do this. Like so I just started doing it. Like. Regardless of like what people thought and shit. Any uh, instruments you play? Nah, I could fuck around on a few things to make it sound like I know what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> okay, okay. All right. Um, newest project you got? What is the latest project? First shit, of all, let's talk. All right, my bad. I just gave you the mic. I'm taking <laughs> it back from you again. My bad. But uh, I just dropped a song, Kingdom Hearts. Y'all yeah, know about Kingdom Hearts, yep. right? Yeah, but yeah. I saw the video. Hell yeah. New Hell York yeah. City. Uh, how long? Yo, y'all was in uh, Times Square, right? Yes, sir. Yeah. Wow, I saw that video. Yeah. yeah Make sure y'all check that out. Kingdom Hearts. Dope Space concept. Boy Kenny. Motherfucking just dropped that shit like three days ago. Uh, how do you get the name Space Boy Kenny? <laughs> All right. So, fucking, I was just, uh, at first I used to go by my, by my regular rap name. I used to go by, my, 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 my rap name is Kendrick. So, I used to go by mm. Kendrick Terrence Hamilton. Mm. <laughs> Can't do that. <laughs> nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's your full real 
<laughs> yeah, That's my full real name, gum, bro. Man. I used to straight go by the gov. I'm thinking because of Kendrick, Kendrick Lamar. Lamar, but nah, also my name. the gov, too. Like, and Kendrick Lamar, yeah, so. yeah. Honestly, Kendrick Lamar is what uh, helped me influence, uh, what influenced me to get uh, my name. Oh, really? I was, like, sleep one day, <laughs> like, just mm-hmm. listening to uh, Damn, I'm pretty sure. Mm-hmm. And then he was just like, Kung Fu Kenny. And I was like, damn, that's just crazy. And I just remember, like, it resonated in my head, and I just started dreaming about it. And then, like, um, at that part where he was, like, saying that, I heard, like, in my head, it was like, Space Boy Kenny. And I was like, yo, what the <laughs> fuck? I was like, that's crazy. And I was like, I have to, bro, I have to. And ever since then, I've been Space Boy Kenny. So you've only had two rap names? Yeah. Wow. Actually, no, that's a lie. That's a lie. <laughs> I to hear the terrible names before that. <laughs> yeah, all right. So my family, like, they used to call me KT. And it's, it's pretty much like a... Uh, it's, yeah, I know. It's you. That, I don't know. That's lame, though. No, like, I see kind of basic. I ain't yeah. like, eh. And then everybody be like, oh, you Katie? And then everybody get it confused, too. They be like, oh, Katie? I'm like, nah, nah. bro, nah. But it stands for, like, my uh, first and my middle initial, my names, too. Okay. Mm-hmm. But, um, yeah, it was KT. Don't ever call me KT. Putting out your project, <laughs> were, there, were there certain producers or certain, uh, yeah, like, producers that you want to work with or like I mean you want to shout those shout them out or honestly bro, I would love to work with Timbaland Timbaland is fucking crazy like mm. I feel like me and Timbaland could create something that's like never been seen on this earth before <laughs> and Mike Dean Mike Dean crazy as fuck yeah. Mike Dean Mike crazy Dean, nice um Metro Boomin be doing his shit I want to bro me and the Metro Boomin tape that would be fucking crazy hey you hear this <laughs> you know what to do come see me come see me <laughs> yeah, Metro Boom is dope. Um, How old are you? Uh, I'm 22. So what was the, because you, what's 22? Out of the co- what's that, second year in college maybe? Oh, Third? graduating college. Graduating college, 22? <laughs> yeah, you're about yeah, graduating yeah. in college. Oh, yeah, high school, 18, I'm tweaking. <laughs> so, 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 I mean, you, you, so I'm sure you never thought about going to college, or did you? <laughs> college was not in your plan. So what? Uh, honestly, I knew I wasn't going to college. My mom would be like, "Yo, like, what you gonna do after school?" I'm like, "I'm gonna make music." She'd be like, "That's it." I'm like, "Yeah, I'm not like, I don't plan on going to college or anything." i have never like my whole life. You, if you asked me if I was going to college, I would tell you no. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. So I there never, no I never bullshitted like I was gonna go to college. I knew I was not about to do that shit. Nah, there was, there was never Plan B. So after high school, what was the moment where you like, yo, I gotta. I gotta kick this in because you gotta you gotta have some some type of income. When did you want to kick this in gear and like do it for real? Um, as far as income, I'm a bad kid, bro. So <laughs> I'm gonna just leave it at that. <laughs> I'm gonna just leave it at that. Yeah, you know, I ain't you know, gotta worry about money. Yeah, it's, oh. no, it's cool. It's cool. All yeah, right. everything's good. Yeah, <laughs> everything's cool. Yo, um, as far as like uh, you you travel, I see you travel a lot from different cities to uh, film your, your music videos, whatnot, you're in Chicago to, to, to do a video, you do it in New York, where other cities do you want to tap into that you want to visually? Honestly, I'm getting kind of bored of America, but. Mm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm just keeping it a buck, but. Yeah. I'm keeping it a buck, but Miami would be cool. I haven't been to Miami yet. I mm-hmm. feel like that'd be dope. Um, I don't know. I'm kind of a sunny kind of guy. I don't like the honestly. Snow. Yeah, over here I don't sucks. like the snow and stuff yeah. like that. Over like, here sucks. <laughs> yeah, don't come here. Like, you know, Minnesota, it's Chicago. Summer, but yeah, sh- Chicago. What's the weather like? Be out here in the fucking summer. And summer is summer dope. Is like cool. summer. Oh, this is like the best city yep. in the world. Oh, summer. Catch me out here in the summer. I ain't coming back in the winter no more. Yeah, summertime. Mm-hmm. You want to be out in summertime. It's like a yeah. festival every Don't week. Don't you feel that wind hit your face, bro? It's different. <laughs> it's really yeah. different. Yeah, it's, it's real out here. <laughs> Uh, I noticed, like, you are a fan of uh, anime, correct? Yes, sir. Favorite character? Tina Turner? <laughs> He's a king anime. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, some oh, of your, my son. My oh, son the was, cartoon. Oh, all right. they, that ain't funny, man. Dude, man. talking about the color of purple. I don't like that question either. Oh, you don't? No, uh, but it's something we could rock with. Let's why, see. Why? Why? Yeah, why? I don't know. I'm no, not it's, it's, it's not offensive. It's just, like, I watch so many animes. And like, look, if you ask me this question again in a month, it's probably going to change, bro. Uh, <laughs> like, it's hard to choose. I'm just going with childhood because, like, you can't lead a childhood out. So, mm-hmm. OG Gohan. Teen Gohan, bro. Teen, Teen Gohan. Gohan. That nigga I, is crazy as fuck. I know fuck. about Teen Gohan, yeah. 
the nigga. Only because of my son. Yeah. Beat that nigga's ass. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Beat sales ass with a broken arm. That's crazy. Um, what was going to say? Anime. Some uh, favorite uh, favorite food that since you you're traveling across America and you're, you're doing videos or whatnot. <laughs> favorite food you like? Uh, I like chicken strips and fucking French fries. <laughs> this nigga basic <laughs> as fuck. <laughs> basic as hell. I'm tired of America, but. <laughs> be, be right. hey, yeah, 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 Pete, we in Chicago, yo. Pizza you gotta be too. pizza, man. Like, <laughs> you gotta have a deep, well, deep dish something. You got, you gotta go yeah, to Gino right. Z's. Gino. You gotta oh, go to Gino Z's. We yeah, we in we Chicago, Chicago man. Dish, like, you, you gotta have a, dish. you gotta have a pie or something, yo. Like, that's crazy. Y'all call it pies and everything, nigga. Just yeah, like, like, pizza. Yeah. <laughs> hey, and, and we better than New York pizza. Like, oh yeah, definitely. Chicago is known for pizza, so. Very. Yeah, very. That shit cracker. Very. It's, a, it's, a, it's cheese on a cracker, yo. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That shit huff. <laughs> yo, I can't even lie. Once you said cheese on a cracker, it just reminded me of all the fucking pizza places I ate at. And yo, you know, that, that shit. Low-key accurate as fuck, bro. That shit dumb, dumb whack. <laughs> cheese on a cracker. <laughs> dumb whack. You know what I'm saying? How, how many tattoos you got? And when did you get your first tattoo? Shit. My first tattoo I got on the back of my neck. Hmm. Whoa. Your first one? Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Tattoos do I have? When did you get that? Like right when I turned 18. Oh, okay. At least you waited. All right. right. When my parents couldn't tell me what the fuck to do. Oh, uh, are you are you a Wiz Khalifa fan? Yeah, I am actually. Wiz Khalifa's cool as fuck. Um, he had, he had a skit on one of his songs where he said, "Hey, people always ask me, what you got all these tattoos for? What if you got to get a job? So has anybody ever asked you that? Because you got this neck, hand, face, face, yep." Um, that's just cause fucking. I know I'm gonna be successful. Like I don't, mm, I don't need to. I like, I like that. I don't need to worry about all that fucking regular people shit. True. No offense. He's not, gonna do it, putting a job at He's not no. punching a clock. <laughs> no. Punching a clock is have not. You ever? Yeah, I have actually. I used to work at Wendy's. <laughs> Wendy's? Oh shit. Sure, used you to there? work at Wendy's. Um, oh, I wasn't. Chicken strips and fries. All right, get it. Yeah. <laughs> honestly, I didn't even put two and two together until you said that shit. That's what I used yeah, to eat every day. Every day. People get tired of it, too. They're like, bro, like, you don't get tired of Wendy's? I don't get tired of Wendy's. Wendy's is one of my favorite restaurants, too. How long were you there? But I was there, like, um, like my last year. I, no, 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 my junior year of high school and my last year of high school. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. But, that's the only job you ever had? Yeah, 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 that's the only job. Actually, no, no, that's a lie, too. All right, so I got caught up in middle school before. Like, this is a, hold on, this is a whole other fucking rabbit hole. <laughs> I, I tell you, I was on some fucking demon kid shit. But this is honestly this ain't that bad. But I was I was smoking weed in middle school in the bathrooms and shit. Got caught up at school, mm-hmm. and for punishment, I ended up having to fucking get a job. <laughs> in middle school, in middle school, yeah, really. middle school as well. Eleven, right. eleven years old. <laughs> what the fuck? At eleven, you can get a job at eleven. Right. Under the table, straight construction. Ah, uh, yeah. What? Was straight pay- construction. Who made you do that? Your parents? My parents. Oh, I was like, uh, school punished you uh, and nah. made you get a job. Nah, yeah, 11, um, what are you doing? Like? Actually, there's this thing called, um, what's it called? It's like they put me in this drug program, too. So, like, um, yeah. yeah. Dare. <laughs> right. Dare. No, no, no. It's it's something other than dare. Dare is some, like, I was on probation and shit. Mm. It was, um, like for real, bro, Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh <laughs> shit! So Damn. I'm trying to. I forgot what it's called too. It's like this thing they do. It's like you, you, like you go to court and shit, and then you have like a certain time of that you have to stay out of trouble. And if you don't stay out of trouble during that time, like everything you did, like it comes back on your record. Oh. Uh, but yeah, fucking, I got caught up smoking weed and shit, and like I had to get a job, and I was working construction at like fucking 12 years old, so. So yeah. at so middle school, you was a rebel rouser, huh? You was a yeah. you was a kid that ran around and, and kicked up dust, huh? <laughs> a lot of fights? A lot of fights? Honestly, no. No. Wow. No honestly, fight. the only time I got into fights, it was like, if you, you know, honestly, the kind of person I am, you know if I get into a fight, the def, the other person definitely deserves that shit, bro. Because <laughs> mm. I'm a chill-ass nigga, bro. I don't be fucking with nobody, bro. Yeah, you like, definitely every seem time, like a laid-back cat, right? Appreciate that, bro. Every time I got into a fight, bro, it was because somebody else was doing something, bro. Mm. Not because of me. But my mom and my dad always taught me not to start shit, finish shit. So that's how I was in school. So every time I got in trouble for a fight, I already knew. I was like, I'm chilling. I'm good. They ain't fisting to beat my ass for nothing. <laughs> mm. 
first, uh, I, I know you say you like Tupac. First, nah, well, actually, like, I mean, I like Tupac, but like, he's not one of my favorite artists type uh, yeah. shit. I, I there fuck we with Biggie. Go. <laughs> He's like, here we go. He, he, he hates Tupac also. I didn't so. say I hate him. Hey, that's, I'm not saying that either. I I'm not saying that. Sounds like you're leaning towards that. No, no, no. <laughs> Everybody <laughs> contradicts I'm himself. Saying, I'm just saying, people try to say Tupac is like one of the best rappers. He like, is. He's no, not. He's not. Bro. His, his flow is very elementary. That's not, come on. Exactly. He changed his flow Bro. a lot, but okay. Did he? Yes. Compared to Biggie, though? Yeah. As far Biggie. as far as tech, uh, technically rapping, saying. Biggie is definitely better. Oh, okay. All right. well, that's all we say. <laughs> Pac is the better, bigger artist, though. Brenda had a baby, but Brenda barely had a brain. <laughs> powerful. Bars. It's powerful. Red. Wow. <laughs> wow. Shout out to Pac and Biggie, though. R.I.P. But yeah, I, I you, look. So I don't, what year? What year were you born? <laughs> I was born in two thousand. Damn, man. <laughs> Fuck me. Uh, yeah, so you don't remember 9 11, 